<clears throat> hey, uh, sort of, sort of taking off from the same. Ugh, hold on, let me try that again. Sort of continuing from the last point. Uh, we're in the same point story-wise, but I've done a lot of grinding. Uh, I tried knocking out a couple of the challenges, just a couple of the easy ones. Um, and that's not really like the big thing here. Uh, like, let me just go and look. I knocked out a few of the easy ones, like. Uh, uh, win without tributing any monsters, uh, win without using any forbidden cards. Uh, did the elemental hero and warrior ones. I think I won without taking damage. Uh, I won a match, um, which you can all do in dual mode, which is much easier when dual without taking damage. Won the map. Oh no, I'm currently trying to do this one. Um, I don't know if I did anyone else, but yeah, I did a few. And then I also beat, I tried many times, and then finally ended up beating the, um, the stupid find your friend or 400 friends mini game, the one that's just like snake with two players. Uh, did that one? That's good. Can't help but notice it's not here. Oh yeah, it is. Okay. So this unlocks vanilla flavored, which which bleh, which has a bunch of like the really good like regular monsters. Uh, all the like 1800, 1900, and uh, like you know Gene Warp Wolf too. So want to buy a bunch of those because those are good for just like but you know having. And this pack is unlocked when you get the golden egg sandwich. So, haven't bought any yet. Let's buy a few. Kind of expensive, but I have a bunch of dual points, so I'm not too worried about it. And then we'll continue trying to chip away at the burn cards uh, because I need them in my life. And then, because that's good. And then we got it's fusion time. Can it's fusion ritual monsters. Definitely want to keep trying to do this because I need another King of the Swamp, even though I already have one. Uh, and then, once again, more heroes. Just hoping for Stratos. <laughs> That's more or less it at this point. Um, let's see what else. Uh, let's just grab a few of each because I didn't seem to get too many of them. And I have a plenty. I have plenty of dual points now. I don't know. It's mostly from dueling and like failing at the mini games. Even failing the mini games gives you some, so it's not terrible. Um, not gonna go for the win pack. I don't really care about that. Um, what's this? Oh, so I'm still missing these two packs. Maybe I should try and get more of these just to try and unlock the next packs. Forgot you have to get like half the packs. It's field spells. I don't need these, but can't hurt. And then. How am I buying? Let's get even more. Um, because burn cards are always great. And then that should be good. Let's just open them all now. So we got um, these are from the intermediate packs. Goblin of Greed, as long as card remains facing your side of the field, neither player can uh, activate an effect by discarding from his or her hand. That's interesting. Tune Mass Sorcerer. Okay, so the tune cards are in like one of the first packs from Beginner Monsters, which is weird. But I'll take it. Counter cleaner. Uh, Flash of the Forbidden Spell. And only when all of your opponent's monster zones are occupied with monsters, destroy all monsters on your opponent's side of the field. That's tough. That's very um, situational. Decrease the attack of a monster at 700. Michi, Michi Zure, which is pretty okay. Fairy of the Spring, or some Summer. Eh. Mask of Dispel, it's okay. Uh, Degenerate Circuits. This card controller of this pace, 500 each of his stamina. Monster cards that would be returned from the field to the hand. And remove the play instead. Interesting. Banner of Courage is pointless. Convulsion of Nature was the f was the meme card that I used in the first Tag Force. Uh, grab a Crushed Dragon. I don't remember this card. Send one continuous spell you control to the graveyard. Destroy one monster your opponent controls. Interesting. Dweller in the Depths is decent. We got a few infinite cards could be used. Uh, Lighten the Load could be used. <clears throat> Some of these aren't too bad. Malice, Dispersion, discard one card from your hand, destroy all face up continuous trap cards. Too, sp too specific. Spirit, bar Spirit Barrier isn't too bad. Um, oh, this is where I guess this is where you get the um, Destiny board cards because that's a Spirit Message L. I didn't bother checking, but that makes sense. Neither player can offer any tr monster as a, tr as a tribute under any conditions. I can declare one monster name if the opponent normal summon special summon flips that monster face up, remove that monster and this card from play. That could be helpful for. Um, Going in specific duelists. I doubt I'll do it, but 
I can see that coming in handy. Um, another metamorphosis. Getting a lot of... Yeah, <laughs> didn't get anything new from uh, its fusion time. Power of the Heroes also continues to uh, cuck me. I'm not getting any of the cards I need. I got a Righteous Justice. That's not bad. Um, surprised it's not like a full rare. I can deal with that, I guess. I'm still going to buy more, but that's not too bad. And then we got... Um, so these are the vanilla ones. These are all just like generic vanilla ones. Order of Charge is good in the vanilla deck. Spiral Serpent. Sword of the Soul Eater. Giant Red Sea Snake. Order to Smash. Despair. I know what all these do. These are all in... Um, or most of these are in um, Dual Links. I'm not getting much. Trihorn Dragon. Eh. Oh, there we go. Octoclops can be used. I already have a Summon Skull, but that's still cool. Amphibian Beast. Um, Seven Colored Salmon I can use. Creature Seizure. Oh yeah, I've seen that before. Huge Revolution. I need to... This is one of the uh, condition cards. This is one of the ones you need to win the effect of, I think. This card can only be activated during your main phase when people running about, oppressed people in United Resistance are face up on your side of the field. Send all cards in your opponent's hand to the graveyard and destroy all cards your opponent controls in the field. That's difficult. Max Raider. Skulldog Marin's not terrible because of the defense. Archfiend Soldier's a good one. A nice heavy hitter. But I didn't get much from that. I thought I'd get better cards. Uh, I guess they're all rare. Attack and receive. I have a bunch now. Curse of Darkness. Each time a spell card is activated, control over that spell takes 1,000 points of damage. Damn. You can mine that with uh, Chain Destruction. That'd be really good for uh, just locking your opponent in place. Mask of the Accursed is a great one. That's awesome. Um, let's see, what else? Hinotama. Uh, yep, can always use those. Ceasefire. This is a good one, and it should be limited. Flip all face down defense position monsters in the field face up. Flip effects are not activated this time. Inflict 500 points to your damage to your, for your, to your opponent for each effect monster in the field. So it's not really the flipping effect that you need to worry about here. It's the fact that you can basically for every effect monster in the field, which there are a lot of. Very rarely do people use uh, normal monsters. 500 points of damage to your opponents. That adds up real quick. And then Poison Mummy is just a meh one. Uh, let me see. Fatal Abacus I've used before, but that's not great. Desk Wall is a really good one. Uh, Desk Wall is 400 points of damage for each card in their opponent's hand, and it's got a decent amount of defense. It's really good for a first turn play. Especially since there's two phases, because they usually don't set until the second phase. Uh, Magical Thorn. When your opponent's cards in their hand are discarded at the graveyard, inflict 500 points of life damage. Yeah. Um... DD Dynamite, inflict 300 points of damage to your opponent for each of your opponent's cards that are play. That's specific. Mass Driver is not good. I'm looking for Wave Motion. Another Just Desserts is good. Unless, did I already have one? That's weird. Um, no, oh no, I think it's adding to him. Destroy one monster in your, one face up monster in your side of the field to inflict 1,000 points of damage to both players' life points. That could be something. Ukazi's a good one. Uh, let me see. Mephist, I don't think is very good. It just does... Oh, this is the uh, drawing one. So this card's, discards one card from your opponent's hand. Oh, it's five star. Fuck off. Secret of the Bandit. Protector of the Sanctuary. When this card is faced upon the field, your opponent cannot draw a card except during draw phase. Eh. Common Charity. Draw two cards and remove one normal monster card from your hand. If you don't have any normal monster cards, send all cards to the graveyard. Uh, Skill Angel. Forest Re Requisition. Uh, something to do with this card. Mind Wipe. Heroes of the Shadows. Oh, so this is also good for milling decks. I wonder if it has um, Warm Worm in here. Terrible Deal. Staring. Hello, Pummer. This is a uh, Merrick's like, level 40 card, I think, or 38. Cyber Archfiend. Ellen Void Drop Off. Koichi. Koichi. Tune. Oh, that's it. Not really great, to be honest. I'm not super thrilled with those. I did unlock the new packs. So that's good. We should have grabbed a bunch of these. I'll grab five of each. I think that's five. No, one more. Um, be great if I can get Mirror Force. I'll grab you more, because trap cards are king in this game. And then, uh, we're going to dig right back into here. I'm not leaving this place until I get a fucking Stratos. 
Should be too hard to get more DP. Um, I'll grab a couple more of these. Just still hoping for some real heavy hitter vanilla monsters. And we'll grab even more of these. Because I like burn decks. And I don't care who knows it. And then I might as well just... Well, I'll end it there, but... Owner's Seal, Unity. These are from the new ones. Uh, Restructor Revolution is a good one. Uh, Dimension Fusion. Pay 2,000 life points. Both players special summon as many of their remove and play monsters as possible. That's very situational, but can be good. Tribute to the Doom is not bad. Ruthless Denial. Reversal Christmas Reincarnation. Timidity. Final Countdown is good because I need it for that um, thing. Ideally, I'd need three of them. Cost Down is not bad. That's not what this one's called. Um, interesting. Some of these are, um, like, anime-only cards, which is interesting. Like, I was, I have the, um, the three Egyptian gods, and they all, because I got, I had it from the, um, UMD recognition. I was looking at their effects, and they're actually all, like, the anime effects. They're not, like, the TCG. Feather of the Phoenix, people don't like this, or I don't see this card get used a lot, but I like it. Um, shift, change experience, when you're up in darkness, my next there's karma cuts. Hero emerges, I'll definitely take. That's a good one. Um, Rain League, Curse of Anubis again. Dark Spirit, this Meteor Rain is good, it just like makes it so your monsters can pierce that turn. Big Burn, Flashbang, on the left, just no Pharaoh. Like Equalizer, Statue of the Wicked. Zero Gravity is not too bad. Um, that can be a good stall card. And. That's all I got for those ones. I got another over over so oh over soul, which is nice. It's not what I wanted though. Another e here. These don't help me. I have too many of these already. <sighs> and a third miracle fusion. Really? This is how much I get before I get Stratos. This is garbage. Uh, another seven colored fish, which is decent. I got just a break, which is like a super rare one. That's the one that people keep using on me. Um, and sea serpent. Is this four star? Oh, this is like, that's weird. It's like the not version. It's like the same card that Kaiba uses that sacrifices for two light monsters, but not the same somehow. Horse Raider, there we go. Starting to get some of the good ones. I'll leave that for now. Uh, Final Flame is another good get. Uh, Coffin Cellar can be good. Hinatama. I'm trying to fill it with the Insta. Okay, Wave Motion Cannon is a really good one. That's fun to use. Alright. And this is. Against my better judgment, I'm just gonna do all the rest just on this power of yours. I want the remaining cards. I just St Stratos is limited to one card. I just want one Stratos. It's my favorite card in this game. I just want it. God damn it! <laughs> I'm getting really upset. It's not even so much that it's like its effect is good. It is, but it's more of just like I just like the design. Just one of my favorite cards. Here we go, game. Come on. Um, I got Dark Bright. I didn't know I, I didn't have him already. You son of a bitch. I got 17 of you and you're not gonna give this to me? You motherfucker. <laughs> I finally got a Blade Edge. I didn't realize I didn't have one already. Uh, or I did notice that. And I got Edge Hammer. Um, destroy one monster, look down, your opponent equal to the original attack of the monster. That's weird. That's a very specific card. Aw, oh, right at the bottom. There he is. Elemental Hero Stratos. Alright, I can finally make the hero deck I want to. That's good, I can finally start buying, stop buying from this pack. I don't know whatever the last one is. Let's look at the uh, pack list and see if I can guess what the last one is. There's Wild Heart, which I have, Miracle Fusion, Oversold, Shining Flare Wingman, Stratos. I got all of the rare cards, or ultra rares. We have E Emergency Call, Blade Edge, Dark Breath, Thunder Giant, Wild Edge, Woodsman, Count, Hero Counterattack, Righteous Justice, Skyscraper 2, I think I have. Spell Striker might be the one I don't have. Edge Hammer, Captain Gold, Fling Wingman, Ocean, Sparkman, Terra Firma, Heat, Necroshade, Wild Wingman, Featherwing, yep. Yep. I think I have all of them now. I don't know whatever one I'm missing, I can't figure it out. I also have level 10 Karibo if I want to try and do that. Um, yeah, that's not too bad. Let's look at the completion rates. So, 53, 68, 61, 55, 63, 56. We're at 90% for fusion and ritual monsters, and I still don't have another King of the Swamp, or my third poly. These are doing pretty well, 58 at that. Um, that's 97, this is 61. I'll go to this one a few times, just because I still want to try and get Gene Warp Wolf, because it's fun. And just a few more 1900 attack monsters. 
Uh, 86% on this one. I don't know if I got Ring of Destruction. I think I might have, but I'm definitely going to have to check. And then uh, nothing of this one because it's dumb. Um, and a few from this one. The drawing, I'm not too worried about the draw cards. I do want to check. I do want to check to see if um, Warm Worm is in that, that deck. Making a mill deck wouldn't be too bad. We have Needle Worm, which is sort of like Worm Worm, uh, but not really. Also, Morphing Jar is in that deck. Um, I don't see it. I don't know why it has Hero, but it doesn't have. Um, it doesn't have Warm Worm. Maybe Warm Worm wasn't created yet. I don't know when that was made. All right, so that was a heaping amount of du dual points. Uh, we're gonna probably just end the day. Can I open up from here? Let's go to the red door. So we've barely made it through into this game because I'm just it's, <laughs> I just keep wasting so much time on like the small stuff. Uh, let's just yeah, we'll end the day. I should definitely save. I should also definitely edit my deck. So let me do that now, before I get some shenanigans pop up. All right. Let's see. Do I want to put Hero Merge in this deck? I don't think I need to. I don't think I have that many monster cards. Um. All right. I have too many cards now. So I have to like constantly use the search menu. But yeah, I um, I ended up making. I didn't make it. I gave like the foundation for um, an Egyptian god deck, and by foundation I mean I just added those three Egyptian gods to the deck, and that's it, so. I don't think King of the Swamp is in this deck again yet. Um, so I want to make sure he's in there. Yeah, somehow didn't add that to the deck, because I'm stupid. Um, well, let's go back here. And then, search menu, deck search, hero. Oh, well, I fucked up. Well, that's okay. I wanted to add these two anyway. Dark Bright, I don't really care about. It's just more of it's it's useful to have because they um. Oh, hold on. It's just useful to have Dark Bright because um. Just synergy. I just like I don't like when I have monsters in my hand and I can't fuse them. It's it's very annoying. That's why Vision Hero is so good. Uh, all right, Tech Search. I'm forgetting how to do this like as I'm doing it. Alright, we got quite a lot here. So, Edge Hammer is dumb. I'm not going to put that in. Um, let's see. I think I have at least a Mariner. That's good. So, these. I don't even need Mariner, really. Um, I definitely want another Beast King of the Swamp, though. So, I'm going to keep trying to get that fusion pack. Um, I have three Sparkmen. That's good. That's what I need. Stratos. Get that in there. Um, your Heat, Thunder Giants. Just do a quick sh uh, fly over here. Two hero signals probably enough. I can throw a third miracle fusion in there. It's always a great card. Uh, Righteous justice, I definitely want to throw in there. Um, it's probably good. What am I gonna take out? Windstorm. I don't really need it. Uh, trap hole is still good as general use. Don't need two skyscraper, I don't think. Especially so I don't keep fucking up the effect and using it on myself. Got a nightmare steel cage. Uh, Hammer shot. I'll get rid of. Fusion sage. I'll keep in. Fifth hope. Um, I actually added this in because. Normally this isn't very useful, but because I'm combining my graveyard with Jaden's, I think it's pretty useful to have, um, do I need three of these? Uh, that's fine. Uh, I think it's useful to combine my graveyard with Jade with, uh, yeah, with Jaden's, so. I'm not too shabby. Um, that's 40. I don't have as much mitigation, though. It's mostly monsters, which can get, uh, rough, but I don't, I'm not too worried about it. I should be worried about it, though. Let's go um, back in. Let's... Oh, man. Alright, let's... Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to narrow the search to... I wish there was a new one. Oh, there is new. Okay. We'll do new. Hold on. New. And then... Even further. Narrow the search to just spell and traps. Um, we'll see any of the goodies I got. Your emerges, I'm still kind of looking at. Um, current shuffle. Ceasefire is good, but it's not, it's not like a, it doesn't stop attacks. Um, 
Let's see. Dimension fusion is not helping. Dimension fusion could work. Because uh, with all the miracle fusion going on, that could be helpful. But I don't know how helpful. Uh, final attack wars, flashbang, forest, 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 um, any, did I even get anything good? Uh, I've definitely got decent cards here, just they're not all, none of them are really good, oh, this could work, Michizure, um, that'd be good for, if they manage this, because I, usually if you have a hero deck, you get a lot of fodder, so that'll be good to throw it back at them. Order to Charge could work, because there's a lot of normal heroes in my deck. Um, and I can still use them even if I threw them in the graveyard. I'm going to leave it out for now. Shield Spirit, target the monster gains 400 attack and defense until the end of this turn. Um, Staunch Defender. Is this the one I think it is? You can only activate when your opponent declares an attack. Select one face of monster in your side of the field. During this turn, your opponent can only collect that card, and your opponent must attack with all face up monsters. No. Um, Trippy to the Doomed? Maybe. I have nothing against that card. That's good for getting cards out of your hand. I'm not. These aren't really good negation. I can use Zero Gravity. I guess that's, that's kind of the same as Windstorm. Except Windstorm only works on the opponent's monsters, so I think it's better. Um, I don't know. Do I have anything that, like, I don't have anything to, like, lower their attack points. Um, as they attack. Let's do... Let's try this one more time. Guard frame. Let's try... Let's see if I can change it. Um, let's do... Destroy spell and trap. We'll destroy monster. And then we'll do... I think lower attack points is on here somewhere. Cannot be destroyed. Restrict attack. Pierce type. Return card. Increase jail. Search attack. I thought it'd be on here. No, I don't see it. It's always weird to me that level monsters have their own, like, thing in these games when there's only so many level monsters. Spell counter. Gamble. Special summon. Cap form. Game original. That's an interesting one. Cover for cards. Uh, I guess just leave it at... Uh... Just leave it where it is. Okay. Let's do very quick go through. Um, <sighs> Last tell by tribute, but I don't really see them doing tribute cards. Castle walls could work. Uh, just chain disappearance. Once we're at the attack of the of a thousand or less, normal summon flips on a roof from play the monster, and your opponent roofs play all monsters the same name in their hand. Deck their deck shuffle. That's strange. I don't know why you'd use that. No, let's do hero merges. No, I'll leave it the way it is. Let's just I don't know. Fuck around here. Trap hole still works. Michizure works. Compulsion works. I read a tribute to the dooms. I do like it, but I can see why it's not always useful. Oh, Oversoul should work, but again, it's more of like a combine it with the opponents. Fusion Gate should work, but still hesitant about using it. Let's get rid of one of the Captain Golds. Alright. There's a lot of um, changing. If there's definitely some, if there's something I forgot to add in that would sound exactly like me, so I believe you. Alright. I like how it says complete I, with the Egyptian god deck when it's literally just the three Egyptian gods. Okay. Let's end the day. I don't know what happens now that Jaden has a full heart from the uh, sandwich. I don't know if I get like a special event. Good morning. It's like I got for you again. I can't wait to see what duelists we encounter. Right. I do want to start dueling all the people I haven't dueled before. Um. I don't duel. Alright, well, that's awkward. You're at a duel school. I think I've definitely dueled these two already. I want to start dueling the people I haven't, just so I can, like, add them to the free duel menu. Um, Yuma and Seidino. You know what, Mash Misawi's always scores first place in written tests. Well, I don't like that guy one bit. If anybody should shine in first place, it should be me. He's the nerve to outshine me every time. I just can't stand it anymore. 
be great if uh, Bastion was with my partner. Hey, how are things going for you? It's a believe in yourself if you want to duel well. Alright, Yuma, let's duel. I believe in myself. It's the idea that you only have your tag partner duel is very strange to me. Alright, just wanted to check the time. <sighs> Still having a lot of fun with this game. And as long as I, if I can do the golden sandwich stuff, I might be able to just breeze through the uh, playthroughs, which would be cool. Because apparently every character gets like different events. But I don't know how to trigger it. Thank you in advance. Jaden's shit. Okay. Jaden has a few cards in his hand. He has the material to make Wild Edge. Oh, you know what? That's what I want to do. I want to add more fusion cards to my deck, but I think I have enough. Um, and then Bulb Man face down. Not a bad start. What's his trap card? I also forgot Foolish Burial was in this game. And Snatch Steel? Get out of here. Alright, well, thank god he actually had Mystical Space Typhoon. Alright. If I can... Let's see. <laughs> I'm trying to think. I need a Polymerization. This is where Blaze Man would come in a lot of handy. Um, activate that. So that's three monsters in the grave. I need five to use, um... Elemental Hero Fifth Hope. Or to use Fifth Hope. Place that. Get hero signal. I'm gonna try and use um, woodsman. I'll try and keep him up. We'll see if that works. Um, yeah, let's see if that works. It's a risky plan, especially since I don't really have anything on the um, on the grave. I'll do this though, because Jaden likes to fuck around. He can use those cards if he needs to. He'll play Heavy Storm without even activating him. Oh, I forgot to flip Bubble Man up. That's okay. Oh, shit. This card is destroyed by battle with your opponent's monster. Is this a DD card? Um, your opponent's monster can play both cards and the opponent's monster that destroyed this card. That doesn't make sense. Why didn't it work? Oh, it did work. I just didn't see. Well, I'm in trouble. That's a good start. Treeborn Frog shit, I didn't even see him use that. How did that get in the grave? And then he's, oh no, he's got a Monarch deck? I'm in trouble. Well, luckily, <laughs> you can still act, I can still use, um, Woodsman. Damn, it's fucking Zabork. Zabork's fun because if you don't have a monster when he summons it, he has to kill himself, which is a pretty funny card effect that I figured out all on my own. Okay. He used Pot of Avarice instead of Fifth Hope, which is strange. I guess it's the same effect. Okay. okay Captain Go. Oh, right, Skyscraper's on the field. I forgot about that. I forgot you could swing over with that. Treeborn Frog again. Ah, oh, fucking Treeborn Frog. Hope they don't synergize well. That's interesting. I wonder where they would go for that. Maybe because they think I won't attack it? Um. Alright, what's in the grave? We have Woodsman, and that's it, because Jaden threw the rest in, instead of using Miracle Fusion, because he's an asshole. Alright, so I can't fuse anything with those, but I'm not too worried about it, I guess. Um, shit. Sparkman I probably shouldn't try to throw in the grave, but I need the hitting power of, um, what do you call it? I need the attack power. Of, uh, Captain Gold. I don't know why I bothered attacking Treeborn Frog. I guess as long as they... I think Treeborn's Frog effect is you can't have a spell or trap in the, in the... Yeah. That's the thing that catches people is that you have to have an empty back row. So, as long as I keep trying to make force them to use Treeborn uh, Frog's effect, then they won't play as many spell or traps. Which is better, I think. I'd rather that. Oh, well, what's this? I don't know this card. Super electromagnetic. Hold on, let me see that. I don't know this card at all. Super electromagnetic Voltec Dragon. Tribute this card by treating one of the following monsters. This card gives the appropriate battle effect. Battery Man. Battery Man. Battery Man. Interesting. This is gonna suck. He's at least a somewhat strong card. Okay, I think, yeah, he'll do it. I was gonna say, he needs a card that can at least swing over. 
fucking treeborn frog. Why can't I remove that one from play? Oh. Shit. That's not good. Swords are revealing light is never good, and especially fighting these two. Alright, you've got fusion recovery. Use it, you jerk. He never uses the cards he should. Kill for the lightning. Okay. Uh, can't fuse these two, so that's not good. Um, although, if they get into the graveyard, fucking kill for the lightning. Um, if they get into the graveyard, Fifth Hope can be used again. Although, I would use Mirror Confusion first, but... How did he... Wait, how did he... Did he summon a new Treeborn Frog? That doesn't make... Oh, I guess you can summon it even... Even if... I just... I guess all you need is a, um... Uh, empty back row. Come on, Jaden. You're better than this. <sighs> he can't use Mirror... Not that he could before. Alright. What's he gonna do here? Did he just... Did he set Stratos? That's not how Stratos is supposed to be played. Could have at least used his effect. What did they just summon? Is that an alien card? Or Zeta Reluctant. When this card is in the graveyard, each time opponent, a monster on your opponent's side of the field is removed from play, special summon one Ava token. And attribute one Ava token instead of the field, special summon this card from your hand. Damn. Because I know I drew all of my burst in tricks and not a single one of my uh, avions. That's cool. That's helpful. I uh, can't do shit. Probably gonna lose soon. That sucks. I thought we were doing pretty well. It's it's not often that their uh, their decks actually synergize this well. You got a destiny draw. I, that's not gonna help you. Why would you do that? You already had it. <laughs> oh man. It is cool that Jaden has the same Destiny or the same Miracle Fusion. Or the same Destiny draw that I do. Alright, so we unlock those two. Jaden doesn't care as long as we uh as long as we dueled. How do I How do I tell when Jaden's like at his next level? Anka and Simon and Shimon. I'll leave these two. And then Terence, Pablo. Walter and Hyde are right. I've dueled enough. Oh, what's this? Gazelle, not bad. So one of the, ooh, this must be where Jaden's event is. Uh but before I do that, one of the things that um I I read online is that one of the best ones to um and one of the best duelists to fight is um this dude. Because he's got a pretty easy deck, or it's one of them also. There's still cards here that I haven't gotten. Royal Magical Library isn't terrible. Weapon choice, or weapon change, I think that's like a temporary um, shield and sword, like a one turn one. Oh shit, Atticus is here. I didn't even know he was in this game. Waha, or haha, wahoo, you seem to be in good shape. Alright, Atticus, how are you feeling? Get ready for a real relationship, keep at it. I guess he probably checks your, uh, your compatibility with your partner because Atticus is ridiculous. That's amazing. Rope of Life's not a bad card either. She and Spy. So he probably knows that I have an event. This is Mindy. That's like uh, Alexis's friend, I think. Can't seem to find the right guy. By the way, do you want something? Or are you just admiring me? Mindy, you're great. Don't change a thing. Microarray. I think that's the defense one. It's ridiculous how many of these cards I know off the top of my head. I'm not okay with that. That's too many. <laughs> it's too many. I should stop. Alright, it's one of these two professors. I think it's probably this one. No, it's definitely the other one. Let's duel the other side. Very well, duel it is. Alright, so these are all single player duels, but that's okay. Apparently this dude just gives like a lot of um, duel points when you win. And he's, I think he has ritual cards. And rituals, unlike duel links, where they're a little easier to play because there's less cards in the deck. Um... They're kind of hard to do. There's not as many searchers. Please show me your results. Okay. Not a terrible start. Could have been better. Um, uh, I'll leave that for now. Leave him in defense mode. He'll probably open with Sonic Bird or Senju or Manju. If I had to guess, to put whatever ritual card he needs in his hand. 
No, no, that's not. That's cheering the mage. I don't remember what his effect is. Does he have a weird effect where he gets extra attack points when he attacks? No. Okay, good. I can't remember his. I think it's something to do with the spell card, yeah. Okay, I don't know why that would be in there. Uh, Alright, here we go. Now we get a good start. Okay, so... I'm gonna throw a spark man in my hand. Actually, let's do... Oh, this is why Stratus is great. I'm gonna summon spark man, spark man, spark man. I can destroy a spell or trap, or I could add a card to my hand. Add the card to my hand. We're gonna add spark man. And then... Fusion summon spark... Or, uh... Yeah, so this is cool because of all the cards in my hand. I like this. I got a lot of options here. Um, how about this one? I could... I could have actually done regular Flame Wingman first, but there's no real... Even though there's no one... No heroes in my graveyard, I'm still gonna go with this one first. Um, I'll leave Woodsman in defense. I don't know what his face down is. I can guess. Probably Sakuretsu. Nope. Whatever it was, didn't count. Okay, so the only thing I have down is um, is Michizura, which doesn't actually stop me from taking damage, so I might not get my um, no damage challenge here. Depends if he plays a monster in defense. What did he play? Premature Burial? It's an interesting choice. Oh, I think... Oh, I guess it forces you to play in attack position. Uh, let's activate another Woodsman. Yeah, why not? Okay, let's see. What can I take out of my grave? Well, I think the only one I can get out of there is, um, Sparkman, yeah. Which I don't think is that helpful. Because it doesn't combine with anyone. Uh, let's do this. Well, no, let's... Uh... I guess I'll play Bersantrix. And then I'll summon Terra Firma. Um, just because I can. I don't know if this gives me more points when I fusion summon and shit like that. Um, got that. I played Bristinatrix, and then I can use O over Soul. Grab Sparkman back. And then... Now I can start using his effect. <laughs> I might as well. This actually powers up both of them. Just by sending cards to the graveyard. Uh, Terra Firma gets stronger attack, and also... Um, Flame Windman gets up by 300 attack points every time. I think there's a trick to this. I remember, I used to do this combo before, but I think if you sacrifice them all, now Shining Hero, or Elemental Hero Shining Flare Wingman is at 4,000 attack. I think you, when you sacrifice him, it counts the 4,000. Yeah, so we're at 11,100. I'll just do a big swing here. See, this I would've got the 10,000 battle damage thing. Of course, it's like, I it's, I never get it when I need it. Not bad, you score 70 points. What? Is he actually scoring me? Or is that just like a line? Well, we won without uh, taking any damage, so that's good. I didn't seem to get a thousand. I got a little over, but that's because I got a high score and a challenge bonus. But I think that's part of it. I think he's just supposed to be one of the higher ones. I guess if you team him up with someone, then that would count. Um, all right. So, that's not too bad. Let's save there. I want to duel Atticus, too. Just to unlock him. Yeah, let's go duel Atticus. I should duel Mindy, too. I want all the face duelists. Atticus, I think, would be a stage 2 duelist. Is that how you greet everyone you meet? And then I think it's cooler. I definitely dueled you already. Oh, he must be with Mindy. I'll unlock both of them right now. Unless there's two of Atticus. I wonder, I haven't seen Zane running around campus, so I wonder if you have to unlock him first or something. Yeah, that makes sense. That's cool, that saves me time. Alexis has another friend, I can't remember the name of it. It's, it's like, <laughs> Atticus is great. I like the idea of him being best friends with Zane in the original series, because they're completely opposite personalities. Alright, Jaden's got few cards he can use. Is he gonna do the uh, 
the combo? Uh, he can. He's got the materials for it. I wish he had just, like... Oh, that's not good. Gene Warp Wolf was not what I was expecting. Wait. Oh, he used... What are you doing, Jaden? <sighs> he doesn't know how to use his own deck. I don't know how to deal with this child. <laughs> Alright, Stratus is in the grave. I can't grab anything with that. Um... Is the other set card? Is it another hero so I can call Haunted? Oh, that could work. Uh, yeah. I can work with this, actually. Here we go. I think it still counts. Yeah. So let's... We'll add Bersinitrix to the hand. Ready? This is a crazy combo here. Fusion Summon... Um... Yeah, we'll Fusion Summon Flare Wingman. I think I can barely swing over him with this, but I'm not I'm not confident that he's not gonna activate some speller trap, because that's how this game works. Um I'll do what I can though. I'll I'll leave it, because I think he I think Jaden also had mirror confusion in his hand, so he can summon it next turn. Uh, I'm not too worried about it. I'll leave it for now. Alright, here we go. What's a speller trap? No, no, it didn't work. Okay, cool. Yeah, bring it. I don't know how I feel about this Atticus. I'll bet it's called a haunt or something, so when I attack... I always hate when they have a face down and they never use it. Also, I forgot to change my uh, challenge and shit. I gotta remember to do that. I don't know what kind of deck Mindy uses. Whips. Oh. Man, everyone has premature burial. I should cancel this right now, because I don't have any better um, speller traps. I'll do that. I don't know what you're planning, but I don't like it. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, she's got one of these decks. I remember I used to run this card. Dark Snake Syndrome does 200 points of damage to you and your opponent, and then at the end, of the fa at the end phase. Then it does 400, then 800, then 1600, then 3200, and then 6400 if you get that far. Oh, cool, he didn't even have to use Miracle Fusion. Although, I think he'll use it now to summon a second one. I don't use Fifth Hope. I Maybe I shouldn't keep Fifth Hope, because it seems like it prioritizes it, which is not how this should work. Also, I just realized Jaden has, like, 20 cards in his extra deck. Uh, <laughs> which is illegal. Um, oh, there we go, another Flame Wingman? I'll take it. I mean, you could have had a Shining Flare Wingman. Yeah, I gotta take Fifth Hope out of my deck, because I didn't realize Jaden... Or I just keep it in my hand. I didn't realize Jaden would uh, prioritize that over Fusion Summoning, which doesn't make any sense. Giant Rat, normally a very good counter here. Um, but with Flame Wingman's effect, it's uh, null and void. It doesn't matter what she summons. I always like the cards like that, the ones that you can like bring more out, like Giant Rat, Mass Dragon, uh, the Insect one, I think it's Flying Kamenaki number one or something. I like their effects, but I don't like when people use them to stall. Hell yeah. Alright. Mm, that was pretty good. Alright, we did it. Sweet. And that's game. Uh, let's not go. We think alike. Let's go swerve on. Alright, good. It's still available. Interesting. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man! <laughs> Nick, oh you're so lucky. There was a special duelist who's looking for you, Nick. I'm so jealous. Hey, hurry up, let's go. I like the idea of Cyrus and Hasselberry just chilling out. Whoa! Hello! Wow, you just beat five in a row. You're better than even Albus Blue, students. Oh, you made it, Nick. She was asking for you earlier. Uh, this is Dark Magician Girl. What? Waifus are in this game now? Ah, there you are, over here. Do you remember how... Do you remember when you beat me during the school festival? Wow, I guess they're taking events from, uh, Tag Force 1, because I know she's available in that game. Sorry, hoping to have a rematch. Will you duel me? Oh, she asked for Nick directly. What could she ask for me? How unfair. Why Nick and not me? Person in a costume. Who is that? Well, no one knows her age or name. I haven't seen her since my first year at the Academy. It's last year. Sorry, but I can't cheer for you this time. Dark Mission Girl, go. Good luck. It's Dark Magician Girl. Did you come here to play again? Ah, sweetness. Put on a great duel, guys. And cheer me on, boys. Ah! Drewsdale seems to be a little overexcited, don't you think? 
There we go. He he he. I did not have a choice in this duel. Oh man, I hope she doesn't have like an actually good deck. Also, I guess this means I can free duel Dark Magician Girl after this. I'll probably pick her as a tag partner too. That'd be pretty cool. Fusion magic. I don't like that. I hope she doesn't use Eye of Tamias or something. I don't think those cards were added for a while. Um, that would mean, I'm assuming Dark Paladin, which is not a good card to go up against. Alright, I have, if I summon him, I want to leave it for second turn. Um, I have Miracle Fusion, so I can use that. If I, I think about this, if I, uh, it's better to play him second turn. I don't have any like I don't have any like negation. So it might be better just to toss that in defense. Yeah, that's not good. I definitely don't want to play Fusion Gate if I can help it. Because if she's got a card if she's got a deck called Fusion Magic, then she's also gonna benefit from Fusion Gate. Don't be marshmallow. And that was better than expected. Uh, I can work with this. Sort of. Um Actually. I can show off uh, Stratus' other effects. Uh, I don't know if it'll be that helpful here. Uh, I could use... Oh, hang on. Yeah, this will work. Okay. So the problem with Righteous Justice, as good of a card as it is, it destroys spell and trap cards equal to the number of face-up elements of hero cards you control. It's not a choice. So if you have one hero, it destroys one card. If you have two heroes, you have to destroy two cards. So you can't activate it. And that includes your own cards. But I can use that to my advantage here, I think. So, summon him, and then I'll add Avion to my hand. This is going to fuck up Miracle Fusion, but it's okay. I could add, um... I always forget that combo. I could just add, um... Uh, Captain Gold to my hand and then get a free Skyscraper, but... We'll do this instead. So I'm going to activate this. Oh. Okay, well. That makes that easy. That's, all right. I was gonna destroy her card and Fusion Gate after I summoned uh, Flame Wingman, but I don't have to do that anymore. I'm still pretty worried about which face down. Oh no! I know this combo. If she summons another um, Magician Valkyrie, then I'm locked and I can't attack any of her monsters, and I have no way of negating that. Okay. Don't summon another one. I think she would have summoned another one if she had it. Maybe? Okay, she said it. It's a good sign. I can work with that. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do. I have to get rid of that immediately, and I can't attack the face down until it's over, too. Um, alright. I'm gonna summon Avion. I can use them to summon Flaming Man. People, um, people say not to rely on Flaming Man, like there are better heroes to go with, I find him very helpful. Especially combined with things like, um, like Skyscraper. Okay. Let's get Hero Signal down there. Alright. I don't know what her other face down is. I'm willing to bet. Actually, I should play it safe. Oh. Well, yeah, I'll play it safe. Make sure I destroy her cards. Because if she has another Magician Valkyrie. I, she would have played a face up, I think, but if she had another, like, heavy defense monster that Stratos could. Yeah, okay. I made the right choice. Stratos wouldn't have been able to swing over that. Alright. She's still got no spell and traps, which is good for me. Oh, good. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Luckily, I don't have to worry about it. Um, I can get rid of that this turn. I'll use a Fifth Hope as the fodder. I still want to use uh, Hero Signal. Play Shadow Spell down as well. So yeah, it forces you to just... Oh, I have to do three? Oh, shit. I shouldn't have played the monster first. That's my own fault. Alright. Order to Fifth Hope. I don't think Hero Signal's got a higher chance of activating because of um, all of my pretty high attack points. Damn it. That was, that was a misplay. I could have done be better there. Another Magic Magician's Valkyrie. Valkyria. That would have been uh, really rough if she got that, that second turn. That would have caught me completely off guard. I forgot that was in this game. 
So I want to make a magician deck. Ugh, I want to make a magician deck, but the problem is that all the magician cards, like Dark Magician, Magician of Chaos, uh, Dark Magic card, and all the support for that, are in the um, Reverse Magic pack, which is unlocked by getting fifty thousand in the coin flipping game with um, that we can do. I've been trying to do that one, and supposedly it says that if you pick Blair, she's the best partner for it. The highest I've gotten is twenty thousand points, which is two wins in a row. I need to get fifty thousand, which is just impossible in my opinion. I don't know if they're... I think, yeah, I think someone must be in the grave. Nope, I fucked up. That's okay. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have put Stratos back up and then I could have got... I could have destroyed the face down. Alright. That was my mistake. I, I'm for, See, it's, I haven't used Stratos in so long, I'm forgetting how to use them. <laughs> That's a good get. Hex Sealed Fusion, too. I'm curious what 15 spell card she has. Because I definitely would have assumed Dark Paladin, but I haven't seen any Dark Magicians. I guess these is a tribute, so of course I wouldn't see him. Unless, but I had fun. Let's play again sometime. Duel bonus. Didn't even get a new duelist or anything? Wow. I also forgot to change the challenge again. I lost again, but thanks. What a fun match. Sorry for the duel. Or thanks for the duel. Sorry to call you all the way over here. Thought I'd win this time for sure. That was a sweet duel, really. Stop making so much noise. What the heck is your problem? Hmm. That's that girl dressed up like Dark Magician Girl. Long time no see. She's come all the way here to sit and see us, and that's all you can say? For instance, that's why no girl wants to be near you. Ah, shit, the only girl for me is Rhodes. I don't want to have to take this from you. No girls want to be near you either. That's because all I care about is Dark Magician Girl. All I care about is my dinos. That's weird. Oh, my dear. Oh, uh, never mind. Bastion. Because he's thinking about. White Magician, Pikaru, whatever it's called. Under condition, she's not here anymore? Well, thanks a lot, Princeton. You scared her away. Don't blame me. I'm not going to sit here and listen to this. I'm going home. Now, don't worry, Cyrus. She'll get the chance to meet her again. She, see, she's a, a what? What do you know about her? Uh, um, nothing. Just forget it. Well, I mean, I was happy. I was able to meet her today. Don't worry, Cyrus. I'm sure she'll be back again someday, right? Yes, if you say so. Because you're always right. Eh, I see my buds all the time. I'm sure if you believe in her, Cyrus, she'll see her again. Because she's a dual spirit. So, did I unlock a second heart, or do I have to end the duel, or end the game? I don't know what happened there. Um, I can't open my menu from here, so I gotta go at least somewhere. Uh, have I gone to the forest? Once or twice, I think. Can't go to the classroom, because class is in session. Uh, is there somewhere I haven't gone yet, to like get the card that's there? I don't know, is this one of the places where they usually have a, uh, a guard? I don't think so. There's these two. I don't know who they are. I'm gonna leave them. Oh, there's one. Hinotama. I'll take it. That's my third one. Alright, before I forget, let's change this up. Uh, I could probably do the 10,000 damage one. 20,000 points of direct damage is kind of tough. I guess there's, um, there's a duelist to look out for. Uh, I forget what his name was, but there's one of the uh, duelists has all like life point gaining cards. And he only he has pretty weak monsters, so you can get a lot of damage done to him. And he's a good one to grind those ones off. But I haven't found him. Um, what's one I can feasibly do? Uh, won the match and the duel and draw without taking damage. I did eight thousand more points of damage during a turn and won the duel. A single attack. Um, I'll do this one. Let's, let's put it at one. Hold on. Let's put this at one win within seven turns. That's not super doable, but I can do it by accident. I'm pretty sure. All right. What am I at here? About 54 minutes. I made the last one kind of long, which means I can make this one long too. How do I increase Jaden's max hearts? Maybe Atticus can tell me. <laughs> Atticus, please. Uh, we get that dude again. That's not the one I'm supposed to duel, though. Woohoo, wow. Uh, you seem to be in good shape. How are you feeling? Think you're ready for a relationship? Keep at it. I don't know what that means. I'll, remember, I'll know the name when I see it, but there was one dude. I can't. I'm surprised at how many duelists there are in this game. Like, every time I think I've fought most of them, there's like, I, there's so many I just never talk to. 
Alright, let's take him to let's take Jaden to the kitchen, see if he gets any more hearts. Give you the red dorm, it's the best place on campus. Alright, so he's getting hearts up, but it doesn't show it like it doesn't show going past that first heart. Alright. He also likes the card shop too, I think. But eh. Pablo and Terrence again. I guess they're the same duelist. I should duel these guys eventually. Um, Cyrus and Gecko. I don't know why those two are together. I also know I don't have to come back here to end the day. It's just like one of those weird things I keep doing by accident. Right, let's try and get to Sunday. Because I think that's when the card tournaments are. Alright, is there like an event out here somewhere? I think there's eight heart events too. So I gotta somehow trigger all those. And this is where all the people are. Why are there so many Opus Blue people here? Fuck off, you have your own dorm. You have your own dorm. Alright. No, nope, I don't see it. Is there like a... Something I'm supposed to do? Is there like a cap on it until a certain amount of time? I don't... I don't know what to do here. Ray and Biven again. I guess the card shop can have random people come in. That's kind of cool. I always try and duel her. I don't know why. Alright. <clears throat> Just force a habit. Let's get some more cards. Just to round this episode out. While I try and figure it out. Oh, I didn't go yesterday. So I missed out on the, um, the attribute pack. That sucks. I would have liked to at least unlock it. Uh, still haven't gotten the Treeborn Frog one. Or did I get Treeborn Frog? I don't know. Uh, let's grab a few of these. Can always use more advanced spell and traps. Definitely need more of the fusion ones. Gonna pour a bunch of resources here. <laughs> grab a few more of this. Uh, I can grab... Oh, we'll leave it that. Grab a bunch more of these. See, I feel like I never... I barely have any dual points now. Send you. That's a good one for uh, ritual decks. If I want to make one of those, Pink Koala, Fusion Gates, Exchange. Why will you not give me? What do you? What do you have against King of the Swamp and Polymerization? Why is Polymerization ultra rare? Let's talk about that. Um, Exchange question. Question's a fun one. Call the name of the first monster found at the bottom of your graveyard. If he or she calls it right, the monster is meant for play. If he or she's wrong, the monster is special summoned to your side of the field. That's good for getting um. That's good as like a free monster reborn. I don't know how the AI works or the how the AI AI works with that though. They might get it every time. Let's grab one card from your hand, remove one face of monster in the field. I think they just released that in Duel Links. Uh reasoning's a fun one. I like using this one. Another special summon. Double summon's a good one. You can definitely use that. Noblement of Extermination. Uh Brain Control is super banned. Um Let's see what we got here. Don't see any good traps. I think I got bamboozled here. This is the card that they gave to Kaiba at the beginning of the uh, tag duel event in um, Duel Links. That was just bullshit because he would use it all the time and force people to lose. Machine Soldier. I thought this was Machina Soldier. Is that a translation thing? I didn't even know he was released yet uh, by the time this game came out. Uh, beast soul swap, return to the hand, one face up beast type monster in your side of the field, and the owner and special summons one beast type monster with the same level. That's, I think, I dueled Jesse one time, and he used that to swap, um, I tried to shadow spell his Topaz Tiger, and he used that, and swapped it out with another one from his hand, so that's a neat, an interesting card. Two of these is good, but I need more. Um, I need three for it to be effective. This isn't a terrible, um, pack. The Earth pack's not too bad. There's a lot of decent, um, Earth monsters. And then... Gemini Elf, that's good. I'm slowly building it up, slowly getting more and more. Meteor of Destruction's a great get. That's a free thousand points of damage. More Hidotama. Less Driver, more of those. Okay. Alright, I can slowly start to build... The next time I build a burn deck and try taking on the Abyss, I'm gonna be... I'm gonna destroy them. Um... Let me just... Quickly go up. No, I didn't want to go. Shit. Class visitor from the abyss. I'm just gonna leave. Class finished. I'm not going crawling. Leave me alone. 
Uh, you're free to go. Just meet some more we can do all right. Let me just try getting a few more. Let's see if I can get him to Yeah, get his friendship event here. Sort of. I don't understand what I need to progress him. It's the same shit it was this morning. I'm just gonna end the day. It's not like I'm missing anything. I don't think they get stronger as the weeks go on, because that would be very unfortunate. Good morning, looks like I'm for you. Is tag tournament today? Hell yes. I'm excited, we're gonna win, no problem. Join the slave for tournament. Did they let me talk first? Yes, thank god. Okay, so this is the first one. This is one of the, um... This is one of the ones you can unlock a card pack with. Um, so if you win the Slifer tournament, you get Celestial Sun. If you win the Raw tournament, you get Banner of Courage. And you get Don't Stop if you win Obelisk Blue. Celestial Sign has Marshmallow, which is very fun to use. Nova Summoner. It's got a lot of um, fairy type monsters, it looks like. Sky, Sur Sky Scourge, Sky Scourge, Banisher, Sanctuary in the Sky. Do Names, Dark Witch, Kelbeck, all those ones. Yeah, I'm less excited now. <laughs> I'm less excited for this one, but um, what's the next one? Banner of Courage for winning the Raw Tournament. Don Zalug. This one has all the six samurai, too. Uh, all the Dark Scorpions and the six samurai. I think the Dark Scorpions are also the anime versions, so they might be stronger. Fusion Sum Sword, Muramase Blade. Is this the card I think it is? No. I thought that was the um, uh, Fusion Blade, but it's not. Uh, yeah. That one doesn't look that good either, actually. <laughs> these decks, here, these cards suck. I've looked at Don't Stop. I think Don't Stop has all, like, banned cards. Like, we have, um, Blacklister Soldier Envoy at the beginning, which is banned. Breaker of the Magical Warrior, which is banned for no reason. Butterfly Dagger Elma, which is also banned for no reason, in my opinion. Change of Heart, Chaos Emperor Dragon Envoy at the end. Cyber Jar, Cyber Steen, Fiber Jar, uh, Harpy's Feather Duster. Uh, Magician of Faith, um, Thousand Eyes Restrict, yeah, Victory Dragon. I think you, and Vic, I think you need Victory Dragon because one of the ones is to win a match um, by using a match-winning effect. So I think they allow you to use the banned cards a few times. But uh, yeah, um, we can unlock those, and then there's a Championship Tournament, which is for spice up your deck, which has all the Arcana Force cards and the Cyber Angels. And the fall wow, this is a lot of cards in it. Or a few. They've got um they've got cards like the fossil dragon warrior. Uh fossil yeah, those ones that um Cro uh, Jim Crow it's not the name Jim Crow, Crocodile Jim used. I don't remember what his name is. The Australian dude with the fucking crocodile on his back. Once he uses um the Cyber Angels that we all know and hate. Um and a few of the Arcana Force cards. I think this was before they were released. So this is like a sneak preview. So that's kinda cool. Um, also has, this doesn't make, oh, okay, so they have the same pack in Tech Force 3, and it has Branak, Dragon of the Ice Barrier on it. It's very confusing, because it said that, but I guess Arcana Force the Light Ruler is the one on this one. So some okay packs, I guess, I'm not really that excited about them, but it's something to do in this game, so, I'm all about that. And I can't save! Oh. Um, when did I last save? Was it after I dueled Dark Magician Girl? What did I do in between now and then? Nothing? I bought some card packs that didn't get anything from them. Um, that's alright. I'll leave it where it was. I'll just X out. I don't think I lost anything significant. I definitely saved after the Dark Magician Girl events. And if I didn't, I'll just do it again. So, alright. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, tune in for the next one.